Guys, meet my new prawn friend. Hey folks, so we're back home. We made it home with the seafood that we bought today. And we were thinking about this, or at least I was thinking about grilling, you know, what to do with the shrimp or the, the prawn. By the way, the prawns are still alive. It, it's been a few hours since we got home. It's already uh, almost 6.30 at night or in the evening. So if you wanna see, right, there they are. I'm not gonna prolong their agony anymore. And um, what we're gonna do tonight is we're just going to throw these on the grill. So we're gonna have some grilled prawns. Uh, I have another package here, uh, which we'll probably will save, um, use it for another dish. Um, but I think we have, we have enough here to, uh, to grill. We have enough for everyone. Hey guys, almost forgot. I also have these. If you're wondering what they are, these are the tuna collars that we bought earlier. Um, and I'm just going to grill them. Uh, first, I'm gonna throw some uh, lemon or uh, calamansi juice, something citrus uh, on them, and then salt and pepper. That's about it. That's all they need. Like that, kind of. Yeah, these are smaller than what I'm used to, but they look like they, have a, they still have a lot of, of meat on them. This one's kind of the biggest one, I think. So what, if you're wondering what these are, um, a lot of the Filipinos know what these are, and uh, the Japanese um, also eat them. Yeah, these are the collars of the fish. So if you've ordered something like hamachi kama, then this is, this is what that is, this is kama. So what we're gonna do with these is, we have some, um, this is calamansi. If you don't have this, you can use lemon. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna throw some, uh, some salt and pepper on here as well. Welcome to the great outdoors, guys. So we have the grill warmed up. Uh, we're just gonna throw the um, our prawns on there, and then we'll cook the um, the tuna collars after the prawns because that's for like drinking. So, um, and you know the prawns will cook fairly quickly. All right, guys, our uh, our grill is hot. Start throwing the prawns on. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab the uh, the bigger ones. And just put this in the back like that, like so. hard to cook shrimp but I think we're okay and we found out you see this I kind of felt sorry this uh, this was a female and you can see that I don't know if you can see the eggs it still had eggs but um, we didn't find that out until the egg sack opened up so oh well these looks like something else Look at this. Like wings almost. We need room. They look like bats. You see them? 
Look at this. It looks like bats. These aren't bats, guys. This is fish. Guys, I don't know if it's too dark for you, but you can see. <laughs> One of my wings broke off. Yeah, it's too, uh, it's starting to cook. So the, um, the tuna collar kind of broke off or broken kind of in half. So um, I guess this is cooking uh, faster than I thought it was gonna be. So we might be eating this with dinner. Guys, if you see, as you can see, my uh, tuna collars are breaking apart because it's so meaty and it's so fatty. I probably will uh, need to take these out very, very soon. So it's getting dark as well. That's why I have my flashlight. All right, guys, I'm done. I'm done with the grilling, the cooking. I think it turned out okay. Um, I actually tasted some, again, the tuna collar started breaking apart um, and that kind of signaled that uh, uh, it was cooked. So I took it out, it looks good. Uh, now it's a all important taste test, right? And also with the shrimp, can't wait to dig into that. So hopefully you, uh, you I wish you guys can enjoy this with me. I know this is gonna be good, but uh, if you get a chance and you see deals like this, you know, grab it because uh, especially if you ne live near the ocean uh, and if it's available to you you know grab it it's really really good otherwise you know unless you are allergic to to seafood or shellfish or anything like that then don't <laughs> so guys thank you for hanging out with me out outside grilling um, i'm certainly going to enjoy this so i'll see you guys uh, next time uh, you know what we'll try the tuna right uh, because we did buy some tuna so we'll try that uh, that's going most for the most part, that's going to be sashimi or poke. One of those. Again, guys, thanks for hanging out. This is John. Peace. Happy eating to us. Bye.